Hey guys, Adrian here. Today we're taking a look at Herd 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 Deluxe for the iPhone. And uh, here we are at the main menu, and basically it is a game where you are controlling these chickens or herding these chickens around about, trying to collect all of these um these uh essentially these stars that give you points. And the faster you do it, the better you get, the more stars. Um, it's a rating out of three star system basically. So the faster you do it, three stars, etc. Etc. So on the main menu here, really, really quickly, uh, just shop. It allows you to go in through in-app purchases, get some stuff to fly by the levels if you're having trouble. Achievements, because it has ties in with Game Center, and options, which allow you to edit basic stuff again, like language, sound, etc. But let's jump right into the gameplay here. Jumping into the uh, thing here, you can see you have a whole bunch of levels here. So tons of levels, and you need a certain amount of stars to get through them. So this game will definitely last you a, a long amount of time in terms of playing here. I'm currently on block. Uh, Bok block, uh, or yeah, is it Bok block there? So you can see here, I'm on a couple of levels here. You can see the stars have gone through the levels. Uh, and just to play some of the levels here, so for example, the basis of this is, it tells you each level you kind of have a different objective. So some you'll have moving bridges, some you'll have stationary bridges, some you'll have holes. And the controls are really simple. Basically putting your finger behind the chicken and kind of steering it in the way you want to go. So uh, you can see here, here's the chicken and you are timed, so you kind of want to uh, get uh, the stars as fast as you can here. So you basically moving your finger around. Oops, you can see here I fell into a hole, and then obviously you, you once you fall into the hole, you have to restart. Uh, but like I said, you just put your finger behind the chicken. You're navigating it, which way you want to go here. So again, we'll do that. And on the right here, it's kind of it's it's kind of like a directional pad which you see here on the bottom here. You can use the directional pad to pan around the actual map if you need to pan. And in that case, I just fell right away. So the controls are a little sensitive. I mean. Uh, it, which makes it a little bit harder, so uh, that's definitely something I've noticed. The controls can kind of offset you right away, but you, so you do got to be really kind of careful. And in, in some cases like this, you have to wait for these bridges that are moving, which cuts down on time. You can see that green bar at the bottom there kind of takes up your time. So you want to move across really fast, and you kind of cause you to have to switch thumbs left and right to kind of move along faster. And you can see here, up, oh, and my chicken just got stuck there, so there's some issues where you get stuck in some cases, but again... Yeah, that probably cut down on my time there. So it's it's kind of weird to control at first, and it does take getting used to. You can see I'm already running out of time here, and I probably didn't even wasn't able to complete the level. Maybe I might be able to if I can hurry across this bridge in time. And oh no, I got stuck. Okay, so you can see there I made it just in the neck of time there. Uh, so you can replay. You can check out other levels. I can move on to the next level, and you can see here uh, you have a different uh, things uh, in different levels like this one I have to take on a turkey in a race so the variety of gameplay is definitely one of the pros you, you have all these different things here in this case I'm doing a race here up oh, and I just want to keep my finger you want to keep the finger behind the chicken otherwise if you kind of deviate from behind the chicken he stops moving all of a sudden so here it looks like I'm actually oh I missed a star there so I'm gonna lose points actually I can go back for it no I'm not gonna go back for it because I'm gonna lose the race so, you know, you can kind of decide whether or not you want to go for all the stars. Oh, oh no, I lost. I lost <laughs> at the end of the second there. Uh, you can kind of decide if you want to go for all the stars to get more points or kind of just race through as fast as you can in some levels. Again, definitely awesome gameplay per levels, and there's just tons of levels. So, you know, definite pros, just the variety of gameplay and the action-packed levels. It comes with so many levels. This one, for example, already comes with, looks like, eight just in this one uh you know map alone and then there's so much more you unlock as you gain stars here with different uh kind of themes uh you can see they're all kind of named after farm stuff along the way uh like i said there's in-app purchases there's all this other stuff you can get along with uh they have social networking built in if you want to share out and stuff like that definitely something to check uh check out i had no issues with it crashing again it runs five on, fine on the iphone 5 it's been updated as of recent so that's awesome again heard 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 deluxe for the iPhone, definitely a game if you want a challenging game that will keep you going and packed with tons of levels. Check it out today.